I'm Michelle. And I'm Kristen. And Michelle and I are Zooming in from Los Altos, California. And we have had the great privilege of getting to work with Andy and being a part of his Koya team. It's been a really positive experience for both Michelle and I and our patients over these last two years. As Andy's mentioned, uh, we've been able to connect nine of our patients with upper extremity lymphedema to help him to develop the day spring. And all we've gotten is totally positive experience results and all kinds of positive comments about the wearability of the device. Um, it's really important for all these people to be able to be moving about and not just be stuck somewhere sitting on a couch plugged into a wall um, and it's also just simple to wear when you're around the house i i'm so pleased to be able to be a part of something that's going to enhance people's quality of life uh, what other things have the patients told you michelle yeah i mean really similar stories to what you mentioned and um, they mentioned that it's really compact it's Slim, it's portable, they can kind of grab it and go. Like I've had a couple of patients actually travel with it, both on plane and just with road trips. And they've mentioned that they appreciate that having it means that they can keep doing their self care routine every day. Like they're really able to minimize gaps. And because many of our participants are in this independent maintenance phase, they know how important consistency is with lymphedema management. Um, but to also reiterate other things that you said, the everyday tasks are really doable. And that's something that they tell us time and again is their favorite part of Day Springs. They're not connected to anything. They can use both of their hands. So they're able to just walk around the house. They can do light household activities. They can grab that remote control off of the coffee table, um, or they can even just walk to the next room to grab their phone. There's just been a lot of appreciation for being able to do these really normal things, but also while treating their arm. One of the most important things besides the mobility of wearing the unit is just how simple it is to put on. They wear um, a liner and a gauntlet, and the engineers on this team have worked incredibly hard to make it be a device that's super easy to put on. And I think that's one of the reasons why we had such high compliance in the study. Um, hey, Michelle, can you share some of the statistical results from the study? The study that we participated in was a non-randomized trial with 34 participants and two clinical sites. We were trying to assess the safety and efficacy of the day spring. So we measured the lymphedema quality of life score as well as taking circumferential measurements of both of their arms before and after each four week period. So what we found was statistically significant improvement in all of the functional endpoints of the quality of life score, as well as overall volume maintenance. There was even up to a 12% reduction for some of the cases. So this means that our preliminary data so far really matches what our patients are telling us. And the great thing was that the reduction was even while they were just doing self-care and maintenance, they weren't coming into the clinic for treatment. Um, one of the other um, great things that comes along with the device is a mobile app, um, staying up with all the uh, latest and greatest ways to measure things. Um, so the frequency and the duration of use is measured, and we have found a 98% compliance during the four-week trials. And I think having that kind of performance data really serves as a motivating factor for the patients. Uh, it's just like any other wearable device that you are tracking your steps with. And then from our perspective as physical therapists, we can have some remote monitoring and that can help us to enhance or maintain the line of communication with the patient. So we're probably gonna be working with them on and off for years to come. So all in all, there's been a lot of positive feedback and anticipation for the day spring. And what our patients are telling us is that it's wearable, it's effective, and most importantly, they would choose to use it as part of their long-term self-care routine.